Dr. Ben Edwards and I were talking about how the fight or flight response shuts down the digestive system, meaning you can't absorb the nutrients you need. Then he pivoted to this, the impact on magnesium absorption, a detail that is absolutely crucial for birth. When you're in a state of fear, your body enzymatically what happens is certain enzymes get engaged um, and start metabolizing their pathways a lot faster. Well, these enzymes rely on minerals to, to function and the one mineral in particular, magnesium. Magnesium runs like 40% of the enzymes in the body. And when you're in a state of fear, you're gonna burn, certain enzymes rev up, you're gonna burn through that magnesium. I call it the magnesium burn rate. And if you're burning through your magnesium, especially throughout an entire pregnancy, then magnesium depletion, especially in that last trimester, last few weeks even, um, is gonna make you more prone to high blood pressure, more prone to um, all kinds of disorders, but from the standpoint of the pelvic girdle, the muscles, ligaments, tendons, we need magnesium to help relax all the soft tissues, muscles. Muscles contract, that's calcium rushing in. Muscles relax when magnesium rushes in. So when we have a diminishment of our magnesium levels, you're not gonna get the same effect from just a, the physical relaxation and the stretch of the pelvic floor, the ligaments and tendons. And you can just imagine, as I alluded to earlier, when you're in a state of fear, you automatically go into a contracted mode on your flexor muscles. There's flexors and extensors. They need, need to be in balance. And especially towards the end of pregnancy and through delivery, being in that flexor dominant which is that fight or flight tension, it's gonna affect the physics of the pelvic girdle. So there are just some mechanical, physical mechanical physics involved um, when it comes to ligaments, tendons, muscles that will predispose um, these moms and babies to having problems during delivery. When your body is in survival mode, it's literally shutting down functions needed for nourishing a pregnancy and the birth. This highlights why finding a calm, supportive birth environment, whether that's a birth center or a home birth, is a valuable option for comfort and safety.